Hi guys, welcome to today's video. In today's video, I'm going to be reviewing the new update, the new playground update. They added a bunch of new things, which I'm going to read off to you guys. Okay, for some reason, my voice got cut out in the beginning, but basically in this version, they added a golf cart. They also added swings, trampolines, various playground items. They've also added glass roofs and also more materials. I assume that's like um, textures. In build mode, there's like various textures and materials. Um, wait, improved wall texture alignment. I want to know what that is. And then they also changed the donation limit. And then also major bug fixes. I feel like that's always like a part of one of their updates is like bug fixes. Okay guys, so I filmed a roleplay video and I still use the old DIY swing idea that I had. You guys will be seeing that in the next few weeks, but I already exported the video and I don't feel like adding a title and saying like I filmed it right before the update. So bear with me. Now this is my experimental plot. I always like to have one extra plot that is good for experimenting. Back there I have like a little mood station. I also have my little thumbnail photo taking thing right here and then some props. Um, but anyways, let's go into build mode. But okay, so let's go to new and oh my gosh, look at that. Oh, you need um, block books for that. We have a rock wall. So I was right. When I saw this on the Everything Blocksburg account, I... A lot of people were saying it was sand, but because it was vertical instead of horizontal, I knew that it was gonna be like a rock climbing wall, but I wanna know where those little things are where you climb on the wall. Rock wall. I don't know if this is like a rock climbing wall, but oh no, 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 it's right here. Never mind, guys, it is right here. So you have a basic one, and then you also have one with like all the climbing materials, which is super cool. And then you also have a sandbox. Oh my gosh, that's so exciting. And then you also have a little sand castle. I'm kind of curious if you can like kick this one like you can at the beach. And then let's see, we also have a little bucket. How cute is that? <gasps> Whoa, oh my gosh, look at that. So we have one that doesn't have um, the fencing. That is so exciting, guys. Oh my gosh. I'm really excited to put these things in our new family house backyard for Aria. I know she's really going to love this. And then we also have two swing sets. So we have a wooden swing set. And then we also have a metal swing set. That is so cool. And then the golf cart, which is 6500 Should I buy it? I don't know if I want to buy it on this plot. Um, you know what? We're gonna buy it. <laughs> and then what else do we have? So this thing right here, I have to buy block books for. It's, what is, how much is it? It's like 340 block books, which I really wanna buy this for Aria. So I think I will save this when we switch to that plot. They just have a glass shelf and the modern coffee table from the last update. So now, I think I was in deck right now. Let's go and build and see what's new. So, oh my gosh, look at that. Wow. Okay, so they do have the glass roof. So let's build some, let's build some rooms here. I don't want to make this too big because I don't know how expensive these are. Um, we'll do like three of these. And then we'll see. Oh, didn't mean to miss that wall. And then we'll see what these glass roofs look like so we have this one. Ooh, look at that so that one is just a flat glass roof oh my gosh i can use this one for the greenhouse guys oh my gosh yes and then this one is a different one this one has like a smaller glass roof i should probably be reading the name so this one is a mansard skylight roof um I think this is pretty cool in like modern homes and stuff like that. And then this one is the pyramid glass roof. We can use a pyramid glass roof for our greenhouse. And then this one's just the flat glass roof as you can see. Nothing too special. In fact, I think I will add doors so we can go inside and see what it looks like from the inside. I'll just add these little door frames right here so we can go ahead and check it out, see what it looks like. It is currently 3.56 a.m. If you are a Roblox YouTuber and whenever you try to film, is it always nighttime when you enter the game? Because for me, it is always nighttime and it I like 
I legit have low patience when it comes to wanting to film videos. Like when I hop into Roblox, I want to film it right away. So I kind of wish the nighttime was kind of like shorter. But anyways, this is what the um, roofs look like. I believe that's all of everything that they've added. So we have everything here. A lot of people have been making these trampolines with the hammocks and just putting a bunch around but now we have actual trampolines so that's pretty exciting in today's video i think that's what i'll be doing i will also be changing up my backyard and adding in all these new playground stuff and we'll see if there's anywhere to add these besides the greenhouse i don't think so all right guys so there is finally some sunlight out so we can see what we are doing a little bit of backlighting but that's okay so right here is the walk climbing wall and it looks like you can climb up of it up of it. <laughs> it looks like you can climb up on it. Um, let's try to climb this one. I don't think we can climb this one. No, we can't climb this one. Just the one with these little pebbles, I guess you can say. And then this is the sandbox right here. And yes, we can kick the sandcastle down and then also rebuild it just like we can at the beach. So I'm really excited. Aria is really gonna love this. And can I do anything with the bucket or is it just for decorations? It looks like it's just for decorations. I think it'd be really cool if you can like carry the bucket and then carry some sand somewhere else or something. Um, that'd be really cool. And then right here is the golf cart. Oops, don't mean to just sit in there. This is the golf cart. And oh my gosh, look at that. Wow, this golf cart goes kind of fast, surprisingly. It's faster than I've seen other vehicles, but oh my gosh, look at that. What if I just use this as a car? That's so funny. That's crazy, guys. Look at that. How cool is that? I don't know if I'm going to keep this on the plot, but I don't know. We'll see. Wait. I looked like I had a second one there for a second. Okay, we're going to go back and repark this. What else is there to review? <gasps> There's a trampoline. And with the tramp, I kind of wish they added a feature where you can just jump. Wait, is that the feature? Or am I just jumping? I don't know, it looked like I was jumping higher than I usually can. Um, if you ever go and adopt me and you go on top of the trampolines, it just like it makes you jump automatically. I kind of wish this trampoline would make you do that too without having to press the space bar. I don't know, it could be different. I'm on um, the computer, so it could be different on mobile. Yeah, it's very basic. This one just has a little netting and this one's perfect for kids so they can't fly out like that like I just did right now. But yeah, those are just the trampolines. And then the swings, let's see, I'm kind of excited about these. Ooh, use. Oh, oh my gosh, yes, wait. Can I swing higher and faster, kind of like an Adopt Me? Right now, I am pressing the W and S keys to see if I can go higher, and it looks like you can go higher. Um, if I'm not pressing the keys, I don't know if you go higher or something, but I'm pressing them to see what that's like. But look how cool that is. Oh my gosh, I'm swinging in Bloxburg. And then right here, let's see, this one's just the same thing too. I think I'm going to add the wood one in my backyard just because my backyard is more like woodsy and mountain-like. This one's more like playground and park lake. So yeah, this is just what these swing sets look like. I'm super excited to be pushing Aria on the swings. She loves the swings and as a child myself, I love the swings. Like I would run so fast when it was recess so I can get a swing. That's how bad it was, but yeah. That's just the swings and the trampolines. Now, let's take a look inside of the building with the new roofs. So this one, it looks like there's, it actually looks like there's nothing on top of the roof if you can see, like, look at that. It looks like there's nothing on top. This would be really good for like museums and stuff. If anyone's ever built like a museum, like an art museum, I think this would be really cool to use as a roof. Um, I'm not sure if anyone's built that yet so far, but that was just an idea. This one, oh, wow, look at this one. It has like a little square in it. That's super cool. I think this one would be really good over kitchens and like modern homes. If you have like an area where um, you want to have a sunroof, I'm sure that if the rooms are bigger, the sunroof would be bigger. And then this one is the pyramid roof, which I really like this one. I'm going to use this one for my greenhouse. So. Yeah, and that is the roof. Um, it's super cool. I'm really glad they added some glass roofs. Um, maybe some glass walls. I don't know if I saw that in there, actually. Okay, so it says added golf cart, which we reviewed. Trampolines, various playground items. We reviewed that too. Glass roof. So there is no glass walls yet. It says they added more materials, which we'll need to see. And then improved wall texture alignment. This wall material, this one is the double brick. So this one looks pretty new. 
What else is there? The puzzles. The puzzle ones look different for some reason. It looks a lot different than what I've saw it before. Um, this one we've already had. This one is uneven stains. So maybe if you were like an artist or if you wanted to do a spot on your town where um, you had like paint spots. I don't know. I don't really know what you would want to do with this. Um, let's see what colors. Let's do like yellow or something. Oh, okay. Um, this one is just um, some leaves or tropical textures. What's this one? Corroded metal. So, okay, so this one looks new too. This one's bark. Okay, so this one looks new. It looks like bark. And then this one's acoustical ceiling tiles. All right, guys, so we are now on the family home plot. I'm kind of curious to see how this will look on the house. Oh my gosh, guys, look at that. <gasps> Wow, that is just beautiful. Oh my gosh. I mean, I still like the one that we had. It was very modern looking, but this one has, you have more of a glass roof on this one. Okay, so that is what the glass roof looks like right there. How exciting is that? So now I'm going to delete this swing set area. So this was the DIY swing set. Ooh, where am I going to put this? Okay, so wow, that is huge. Oh my gosh. I don't know if I have room, guys. <laughs> no. I might have to like fix some things or move things around in here. Um, what if I just put it this way? Actually, you know what? I think we can fit everything just by adding it this way. Ooh, yeah, we're gonna leave it to that color and then this color I'm gonna change to this taupe color. A lot of you have been asking what color pink I use in my house and the color that I use in my house is salmon right here. As you can see, my backyard is very crowded right now so I don't really know where to add the trampoline and the sandbox. I think I'm gonna add the sandbox back here. I made some room back here because this area was just filled by a tree. Um, I think that's what I'll do. I'll add the sandbox back here, kind of tilt it, and then the little, the little bucket and the sandcastle. Let's see, I'm going to put that right here. Where do I want to put the trampoline? Because I legit have no space in the, this backyard. Look at that. Oh my goodness, this backyard's going to be crowded. I guess we're just going to add it right here for now until we can figure it out where to put it. There's a rock climbing wall, but I don't know if I want to add that because we have one right here already. All right guys, so I have finished adding everything into this backyard and I also added in some other things. So over here, because when you go down the slide, I was afraid of Aria hitting the tree right here. So I put some cones just to, you know, remind her that um, be careful because this thing runs into the tree. Um, I tried to move this backwards, but it just didn't look right. My backyard is just super, super small, but I just noticed like when you go all the way up here, you can look through this little kaleidoscope thing and then also drive like regular playgrounds. And if you go down here, well, you can't hit... You hit the cones instead of the tree. But if you go all the way up here in the playhouse, or not the playhouse, but the treehouse, I added in some toys for the kids to play. Um, we have some like cars, a unicorn, a robot, a little sand bucket, and then this little cute little sun thing that I always see. Um, I keep forgetting to change the color of this ladder to like a wood brown. But yeah, this is just what Arya's little playground looks like. We have the swings. Wait, can you go on the swings? Wait a second. Wait. How come it doesn't allow you to go on swings? Oh, okay, there it is. Okay, that makes sense now. I was gonna be afraid that I bought this and I can't use a swing. So yeah, this is just what the little swings look like. How cute is that? Oh my gosh. This is just like one of the best yet updates that Bloxburg has. Over here we have a little sandbox. I was afraid of not having room in this backyard for anything. As you can see, it's very crowded. But over here, I just had this tree and I just moved it back so I can add some space for this little sandbox over here. And then I also moved this um, fire pit area a little bit closer to over here just because it was a little further outwards towards the playground and I really wanted some space over here for like kids to play. We also have a little cute trampoline right here. So yeah, um, I'm not really sure where to put the trampoline just yet, um, but anyways, this is just what the backyard looks like. And then over here, I added in a new sunroof, and it's super nice. Um, actually, the lights, I should probably delete those lights now because I don't really need it since the sun is what's giving this little room um, lighting. So I'm going to go ahead and delete that. Okay, so we've deleted the lights now. That's going to help us save on some of the bills at least. 
Okay, but that is just what the sunroof looks like without the lighting. It's not super bright in here, which I thought it would be. In fact, it's very shadowy. I wish the sun like would add more lighting through the sunroof, but it's okay. It'll do for now. But anyways, this is just the little playground. It is super cute, and I'm super excited for Aria to finally play in her new playground backyard so yeah so anyways that is going to be it for this video i really hope that you guys enjoyed thank you so much for watching and liking my videos and then also joining me in the game i love you guys so much and i will see you guys in my next video hold on i need to like wave to you guys because i really like doing this see you guys in my next video bye guys